Hey, what do you think you're doing? Don't touch my bag. It looks fun when you do it. But I wanted to punch it too. Fun? Are you stupid? It's not a game. <sighs> That's tiring. Are you hungry, Kata? What the hell is it with you and this stuff? You mean, you don't know? No! This is Chawan Mushi. A traditional Japanese food. A mixture of egg and broth and... Heaven. I know what it is! That's not what I meant! Please let me punch this moron in his dumbass face, just once. I swear, not another word, or I will jam my fist down your throat. Uh, okay. That's a word! Damn it! Is it that you can't listen, or you won't? girl's funeral. It was a simple ceremony for those who had passed away. It was up at one of the community centers. I'm fine. Sorry to worry you, kid. She was a good person. I wish I could have seen her off in a better way. Something sweet and beautiful. That would have fit her. What? You think she was too good for me? Well, you're damn right about that. <laughs> oh, really? I guess the voice of my conscience sounds a lot like you then. How could a girl like that fall for a loser like me? Chalk it up to one of life's great mysteries. You know, you should write a book about it. Unidentified loving object. A great girl and her idiot boyfriend. It'd <laughs> sell millions. Yeah, that's what I wanted to hear. I guess either way, I was a pretty pathetic excuse for a boyfriend. But maybe I can make it up to her when I get to heaven. I hope by then I can be a man she'd brag about. I wonder if she'd wait that long for me. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I'm probably gonna go to hell anyways. Hmm? Oh, it's almost time. I need to go help clean up, but I'll be done in a jiff. No, I left myself enough time. I'm never gonna be late ever again. Thanks. For everything. I'll see you later. that box over there this one here you go no the blue one over there careful it's full of sharp instruments I know I know ah! totally fine. Oh, hey! Irie's helping out. I'm not sure why, though.
Yeah, but I've been failing really hard. It's all right, Irie. Everyone makes mistakes. This is only your first experience with this stuff, after all. <sighs> I guess this isn't my calling either. Irie? Work where people's lives hang in the balance needs a careful, non-clumsy person. Maybe I shouldn't get involved. Maybe something that makes everyone happy would be more up my alley. <laughs> yeah, that's perfect, right? Yeah, I knew you'd understand. I'm testing out different things to see if any of them fit me. You never know until you try. Oh, is that what this is all about? It's nice to be young. <laughs> I'm sorry, Otome. I'm off to try something new. And off she goes. Right back to her sugar rush self. I was worried for a moment. Hmm. Could it be that you had a little something to do with this? <laughs> You're quite popular around here. from you. Remember when you and I asked me to dance? Ever since, other people have been asking too, and I'm always happy to perform. It's fun for me and for the audience. It makes me so giddy. Dance can be useful. Dance is useful. Yeah, I'd forgotten the true meaning of dance. Maybe my dancing can make this messed up world a little brighter. I want to do all I can to make the world a better place. I... I really love dancing. I'm glad I was able to remember that. If you ever want to see the show, come on by. Heck, I'll teach you how to do it. Hmm, for you, I suggest pole dancing. That ought to be fun. go I've done nothing wrong please liar you don't deserve to go free yeah why should you get to live while my daughter doesn't hey what's going on you bastards what the hell are you doing back off this guy's a wanted criminal what? He's a thief! I saw him on TV! He deserves to die! <coughs> no, you're wrong. What? If you want to hurt him, you have to get past me first. What the hell? We probably shouldn't fight that guy. He looks pretty buff. What an idiot. Thinks he's some kind of hero, huh? Mm. 
<laughs> Thanks, you. Oh, you saved my life. Get lost. Huh? I wasn't saving you. I was stopping them. I'd never approve of what they were doing, but you are still a criminal. But... Didn't you hear me? Get out of here! Uh, right. You were watching, weren't you? Good people die while thieves get to live. It's hard to take in. Do I have to accept it? No? <sighs> Maybe not. The world may change, but he did commit crimes in the past. That doesn't go away. Still, they were acting like monsters. It's not right. It's not justice. It's not my call to make anymore, after losing to you. The world rests in your hands. Demons had taken it easy on me. Do I look all right? All these demons started appearing, so I went to go see what was going on, right? And then, well, you know how it is when demons get pissed. Injuries happen. Yeah, I took them on, all by myself. Remember when we saved Hinako? Well, that got me thinking. I didn't like having to fight demons. I hated that the world was turning into this. I thought, why did it have to be me doing this? Couldn't it have been someone else? But when I run away, someone else gets hurt. Seeing Hinako made me realize that. And I hate the thought of that. I hate it a lot more than getting hurt myself. That's why I decided to fight. I mean, it's still scary. And I still don't like fighting, but if I keep at it, nobody gets hurt, yeah? That's what you've been saying all along. I think this is what you meant. So, thank you. <laughs> Come on, dude. I'm pouring my heart out to you here. Anyways, I'm gonna go get this arm checked out. I'll see you later, man. And... thanks. Hello, Shining One. Has the will of the species yet been determined? I see. This may sound harsh, but the problem is humanity's alone to solve. There is no outside help to find. Shining One, I know now that you shall fall into confusion, harm, and meet great difficulty. If we call that which has yet to come on the axis of time the future, then it shall be so. Listen well, Shining One. I do not know the future. It cannot be called that. The images of death sent of Nicaea. These cannot be called predictions of the future. You do not understand. What you call the future does not truly exist. The world proceeds along a predetermined path. It contains neither past nor future. Mom, Dad, I'm okay now. 
You don't need to worry about me. Oh! I didn't see you there. I was... talking to my parents. I wanted to tell them I'm okay, and I'll go on living for them. <sighs> they were always telling me to express myself more. I thought they were wrong, that it was better to keep quiet than risk making enemies. Irie and Hinako said that too. I think you guys have been right all along. Remember when I talked to that boy before? The one who wanted to end it all? I told him how I felt. I stood by my own opinions. And it changed his mind. He wanted to live. It's all thanks to you. You've been there, encouraging me every step of the way. Thank you. I'm so glad I saw you that day. If I hadn't, who knows where I'd be right now. Well, I I'm gonna go. Thank you so much. Hmm? Oh, strange to see you here. The machine can't be fixed, all my data has been lost, so I'm just made of free time. It's been so long since I've had spare time, I may have forgotten how to occupy myself. Spacing out like this reminds me of what Charles used to say. Charles was my host father, from the photo, remember? He said, Fumi, spare time is a treasure. Spare time created culture. At first I thought, this old man is making no sense. But I think I finally understand. I guess it's for the best. I shouldn't even be doing tests if they get out of hand like that. I kind of feel bad about Jungo. The way I see it, I'm damn good at research, but not so good at what makes a human, human. Thanks. You've introduced me to an entirely new field of research, and I'm all over it. Oh, I just had a brilliant idea. All I need are rare elements, combined with a solid hypothesis, and a dash of science. <laughs> no, it's an application of nuclear MRI spectroscopy, without a superconductor, obviously. Now I have something to occupy my time, so, <laughs> see ya! Hey there! Nice work still being alive in all that junk! sad when I said I was gonna leave yesterday? Sorry! It was just all the super serious Nicaea death video stuff that ended. <laughs> you already downloaded me, so you can use the app all you like. And besides, I love hanging out with you, sweetie. I'll always be with ya. Or, I guess it's more like I'll go wherever you do from my comfy spot in your pocket. <laughs> well, let's get this show on the road! I kind of threw together a summary of all the stuff you did today. Well, want to hear it? Do ya? Do ya? <laughs> That's great! Well then, here we go. You got all wakey-wakey and chit-chatted it up with Daichi and all the others. You talked about Nagoya and Osaka and Tokyo and other stuff. Then those mean Osaka jerks invaded Tokyo and you floated like a butterfly and stung like a bee and sent them packing. After that, you went to Nagoya and the girls tried to catch you in a trap and you were all not today and totally won there too. And then Bennett now showed up. That dude is way uncool. It blocked all your attacks and then sealed away your demons. Who does that? 
Good move getting the heck out of Dodge to come up with a plan. <laughs> At least you got to take out your frustration by giving Yammy and Ronnie the smackdown. Then you discovered that you could use Trumpeter to stop the Net Nash. So you decided to summon him and use his rockin' tunes to stop the Septentrion's super cheap moves. Then you came back and beat the living daylights out of Bennett Nash. Good job. Um, I think that's everything I need to tell ya. Alright then, have a nice week!